Hoshea, chapter 8. Set the sounding horn to thy mouth, as an eagle he cometh against the house of Yahweh, because they have transgressed my covenant and trespassed against my law. They shall cry to me, My God, we, Israel, know thee. Israel hath cast off that which is good. The enemy shall pursue him. They have set up kings, but not by me. They have made princes, and I knew it not. Of their silver and their gold have they made them idols, that they be cut off. He hath cast off thy calf, O Shamron. My anger is kindled against them. How long will it be before they attain to innocency? For from Yisrael is even this, the workman made it, and it is no god. Yea, the calf of Shamron shall be broken in pieces. For they sow the wind, and they shall reap the whirlwind. He hath no standing grain. The blade shall yield no meal. If so be it yield, strangers shall swallow it up. Yisrael is swallowed up. Now are they among the nations as a vessel wherein none delighteth. For they are gone up to Ashur like a wild donkey alone by himself. Ephraim hath hired lovers. Yea, though they hire among the nations, now will I gather them. And they begin to be diminished by reason of the burden of the king of princes. Because Ephraim hath multiplied altars for sinning, altars have been to him for sinning. I wrote for him the myriad things of my law, but they are counted as a strange thing. As for the sacrifices of my offerings, they sacrifice flesh and eat it, but Yahweh accepteth them not. Now will he remember their iniquity and visit their sins. They shall return to Mithraim. For Yisrael hath forgotten his maker and built palaces, and Yehudah hath multiplied fortified cities, but I will send a fire upon his cities and it shall devour the castles thereof.